Hello everybody, Madison here and welcome back to my channel. So before we get into the video, I know my face looks like this. I've put up with it since Monday. Um, I use this acne kit and my skin is like really, really, really sensitive and it was like bloody strong stuff. And um, I put it on my face and this is what happens after two days of me using it. Um, I've got sensitive skin by taking this tablet f when I was younger, which made has made my skin really sensitive, which is rubbish. So I've just got to wear Factor 50 and in the sun and be careful about this and live with it for the rest of my life. Not this. It's going to stay on for a couple of days, but knowing that can occur at any moment. Anyway, into the video. So today's video is about ed education. I know everyone can't isn't in education now. Well, they are, but they choose when they want to do it because they get to sleep in and everything. But um, I've finished education so there's i've got no more videos of tour around college or tour around my school type thing i finished my education today and obviously not being able to be at college has broken my heart because i wanted to say my final goodbye to health and social care and knowing that I could never do that hurts and um sorry like health and social care has been a life-changing course for me so that it's taught me so many different things that I never thought I'd be able to do and the teachers were lovely. The people on the course were amazing. And um, I'm actually crying, sorry. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna miss health and social care a lot. And um, even though I work at the theatre at college, working at the theatre in college is one thing, and um, having your education over is another thing. And it just kills knowing that I won't be able to see anyone again. And um, it's been really difficult, really hard as well. But I just have, had to face it. I said my um, final goodbyes to all my teachers today. Because we have Microsoft Teams where we can all, like, communicate and everything. So, yeah. I want to thank all my teachers and all the staff members at Trowbridge College. I thank you so much. Over these past three years, so that's my old tutor that's left Performing Arts. That was my... That's the current tutor of performing arts as well. I had two tutors in performing arts. One for my first year and one for my second year. And that's all three teachers of health and social care. And my tutor teacher for health and social care. And every single staff member there. Because without them, my education, everyone's education would be non-existent at the moment and my health and social care teacher I won't name her because confidentiality um she's seen me at my worst state ever and she's pulled me through and I can't thank her enough so she probably won't be watching this video but there's a 
low percent chance that she is. So if you're watching this, thank you. If any teacher's watching this, thank you. I appreciate it so much. If any teacher on the world is watching this, I doubt they will, but if your parents are teachers, you could show them. Or a family member's teachers, show them. I am so grateful. Like, you see the worst of students, you see the best of students, but the best thing is, you never give up. Thank you. It's been life-changing for me. Like, I walked into college my first year, I knew nobody. Like, I walked, I walked into college alone, and I knew nobody, and then I saw one of my mates in performing arts and honestly I was like thank god but then I changed to health and social care and then I didn't know anyone and I felt so bad I felt so lonely and then I made friends with the whole of the class which is so nice but yeah, the hardest lot for me, the hardest course, well, both the courses were extremely different. Like, performing arts was practical based, and health and social care was theory based. They were both exceptionally hard, and I passed both of them. And, um, like, with my college years, I think the first two years of college, I could have done health and social care and got all the knowledge I need to for health and social care. Then I could have done something else. And, but it hasn't annoyed me or anything. But, yeah... Well, that's all for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed. So, stay tuned for next week's video. I never say that and I never will say that again. Um, now I'm out of education, I can finally think of ideas. Hopefully, better ideas anyway. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Like, comment, subscribe if you're new and I'll sure catch you later. Bye!